Hey there guys, what's going on? So it's that time again here on my channel where the inner music journalist in me examines the latest and the best of what's around when it comes to music here on the interwebs. And since we don't exactly have anything full length to discuss today, it's in moments like these where we dig deep yet get a little more simple all at once. In this case, and in part two of the next video to follow, we're going to talk singles. The great audio equivalent of the teaser trailer to a film or the prologue written to what could very well be the next great novel. They are often fun, sometimes unexpected, and occasionally entirely unwanted previews as to what may lie in store. So without further ado, let's get right into the heart of the matter. First off, we have Jukebox the Ghost with their single, The Great Unknown, which will allegedly feature on an album by the same name coming in the fall of this year. This will be their fourth record, and right off the bat, this title track feels like a close cousin to the narrative of their prior effort, Safe Travels. And that's not at all a bad thing. It's an upbeat anthem of sorts, initially led by a few piano flourishes and Ben Thornawill's welcoming vocals coating the scenery, before building up into a soulful pulse that's aided by Jesse Kristen's ever-valuable stick work and a group of backing voices screaming, the time is now. It contains more of that intimacy that Safe Travels cracked into, while at the same time keeping that pop with a racing pulse style that Jukebox is so ably suited for. It aches to make you raise your fists triumphantly, and play it over and over again. Next up, we switch gears over to Jay Maskus with his single Every Morning, which is due to emerge on his next solo record, Tied to a Star, currently slated for an August 26th release. It's technically the latest in a line of several solo albums he's released over the years, but his second that seems like it's more in line with his prior one, 2011's Several Shades of Why. And indeed, that is a vibe that immediately occurs with Every Morning, which fortunately is not a Sugar Ray cover, but does show more growth in this quieter, acoustic-fed side of Jay. For instance, those milder guitars are still there, but they feel less contemplative and more sped up and spruced alongside Mascus and his signature electric solos that merge in and out here. The melodies are present as well, but feel bigger and a tad more orchestrated as compared to a large part of what was on Several Shades. It's an evolution that continues to nicely suit another heavy rock icon, and I for one can't wait to see what further vulnerability slips through on Tied to a Star. And finally, in this rapid-fire section, we wrap things up here with a will it or won't it be. By that, I'm referring to Ryan Adams, his new song, Gimme Something Good, and the question of will it or won't it be a single for his next LP. Rumors continue to wildly swing and abound all over the place between the idea that the track will emerge on his next full length, potentially due by late fall of 2014, or this being little more than just the first in a series of 7-inch vinyl singles that actually are a definite for release. Whatever the case may be, fans of Adams have indeed been waiting for something good out of the once hyper-prolific artist, and while a single song won't do all the convincing right away, this is a pretty good start. While it lacks a bit lyrically, the slinky, 80s-vibed guitars, flowing organ work, loose production style, and Adams breaking away from all the strictly unplugged stuff is a welcome return to form. It's not quite his Smith's sneering emulation on Love is Hell, but it's definitely not his saccharine lace muddling of Easy Tiger either. If it's little more than a single, so be it, but if it's Ryan's latest excursion down the musical path towards a full-length album, definitely consider me excited for what might be in store. But that's it, and that's all for my little preview of the singles for Jukebox the Ghost with The Great Unknown, Jay Maskus with Every Morning, and Ryan Adams with the potential single Gimme Something Good. They certainly promise for a lot of strong possibility, and make the latter half of 2014 look like a strong one for the music that's coming down the grapevine. Now go, 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 get yourself out of here, guys, and go watch part two of this installment. No spoilers, but I will promise someone's definitely not like one of the guys. Someone has a song to honor one of the greats, and another, well, he and his bunch of songs are a story that at best constitutes words of both praise and abuse. But that's it. Go watch, and stay tuned.